I need to start getting organised. I want to ring the cemetery where Nan's buried and see if there's a place there for Mum. And then I'll ring the funeral home and make a check-in. Um, I know all that stuff needs to be done, but maybe not right now. You don't have to do this by yourself, kid. And we wouldn't mind being involved in the decision-making. No offence, Tony, but I think it's better if I do it. I don't want anything overlooked, and if we divide it up, it's going to get messy. Yeah, but like Rachel said, you need to get some rest. I've had a baby. I'm not an invalid. Yeah, but you know what she means. You don't want to overdo it. I'm going to sit on the lounge and make some phone calls. It's not exactly overdoing it, is it? No matter how many of those things I turn up to, I don't think I'll ever get used to them. It's so surreal. All busted glass, and twisted metal. Then you go up to the driver's window, and it's someone you know. I can live with that. That's a part of my job, but Dad didn't need to see it. <laughs> when his car pulled up, I just wanted to get him out of there, and I wasn't fast enough. There is nothing you could have done to stop Tony from seeing that. It's just bad timing. I've never seen him like this, Martha. Not even when Mum died. Yeah, I'm told that she's buried there. No, I don't have a plot number. Yeah, you do? OK, well, the reason I'm calling um, is my mum just died. Yeah, OK, thank you. You do? OK, great. Yep, I can do that. Thank you. Bye. There's the cemetery where Nan's buried. They have a place for Mum. All I have to do is confirm it. If I just ring the travel agent now and book the flights. Actually, I should probably ring the boys first. Can you just stop it? What? Mum's dead. <coughs> yes, I know that. It doesn't feel like it. Um, Maddie, everyone no, should be She hasn't even cried yet. She's too busy organising everything. Well, who else is going to do it, Matilda? The boys? They're not here. What about you? Do you want to do it? We can do it together, but we don't have to do it now. Yes, we do. No, we don't. Guys. And the only reason that you're doing it is because you can't handle what you're feeling. You have no idea how Oh, you're I not feel. feeling anything. That's the point. I'm just not being self-indulgent. Mum is the only thing that matters right now. If you grew up a little bit, maybe... Oh, well, you two give it a damn rest, OK? Today has been bad enough as it is. How do you think your mother would have wanted this? <laughs> Five orphaned kids. You had any idea what you've done? I didn't. I didn't know somebody had. Yeah, Beth. Beth Hunter was her name, and you have killed her. They didn't tell me. Oh, I didn't know. It was an accident. Oh, I'm so sorry. Shut up about the funeral, as if Tony hasn't been through enough already today. Hey, I'm not even sure what he was doing there. I'm an idiot. It's been a big day. Both of you. Tipper, I'm sorry. I thought I was handling it so that you didn't have to, but I think you're right. I didn't want to let myself cry because what if I start and I can't stop?
No, not really. I almost did a really stupid thing, Jack. 